Hi, Gary Galka here at DAS. What you're looking at right now is a new magnetic field anomaly detector pod that we just created. What this device does is it detects natural fluctuations uh, that occur within the Earth's natural magnetic field. So any disturbances, anomalies, or fluctuations can be discerned and those changes are depicted using a series of LED lights and audible tones. The lights that occur will illustrate polarity changes within that field. We use a series of red and green lights and if those polarity changes occur you can see a change from green to red or from red to green. The device is very sensitive. It can detect changes up to 25 inches away, sometimes a little bit further. There are two buttons located on the side, if you take a look on the edge. Button number one is designated to allow changing the range in steps of one through five. When you first turn it on, it defaults to a range of 1 or the least sensitive and you can increment up to level 5. Level 5 is very very sensitive. Button number 2 is our baseline. So if you're in an area and you're getting some slight disturbances you simply press that button and it automatically tears or baselines to the given environment. Okay let's turn on the device. On the bottom we have a 9 volt alkaline battery and our on off switch. You press in the switch, we, we get a quick diagnostic check. You can see that we're detecting something right now, so I'm going to baseline. Okay, so now we just baselined. I'm going to set this right now for a sensitivity setting of 3. So every time I press button number one, you'll see lights coming on the top to designate the sensitivity level that was selected. There's two, and there's three. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to turn off the lights, and I'm going to take a magnet, and I'm going to move it around the environment at a distance of about 20 inches. So let's take that next. lights out. You can see that the top surface glows. The reason for it glowing is so that you can see it in the dark. You don't stumble over it. And let's, um, let's uh, bring a magnet into the picture here. Okay, you can see right now I'm about 20 inches away. You actually can't see it in the dark, but I'm going to move the magnet a little bit more. Okay. Now I'm going to reverse the magnet so we get a different polarity. There we go. That will give you a little bit of an idea on what to expect if there's a polarity change. Okay, so this is a natural field magnetic detector configured into one of our pods and uh, this is something new from DAS.